But there will also be people watching who are saying, the bloke's not bigger than the game. If he doesn't like what he's got to work with, he can bugger off the league. Are you saying that if there's no change, if nothing changes, um, then you have played your last game for the Wallabies? Yeah, well, that's basically it. I can also announce that Quade Cooper will make his professional boxing debut on the card. He's fighting as part of the WBA code. Of... Now tell me who can stop me Here's Cooper here, let's have a look at this He comes in to put on a hit on the paper My young, all about the W I'ma bring it home when it's over with I'ma be the king of the show Now who can stop me I'm in the zone, competition's not in the league My young, all about the W I'ma bring it home when it's over with I'ma be the king of the show I'm in the zone Now he wants it Cooper Long time. The first thing everybody asked me was, did it feel a pop? And I, I yelled like a girl. Oh, it's at least the medial, maybe the anterior cruciate is gone as well. It's, it's such a weird feeling. You, you know there's something wrong and I went to move it. If you were picked, tell me, if you were picked again to play this weekend, would you play? Well, no. But this isn't about league, this isn't about contract negotiations, this is about a frustrated footballer that just wants to do his best for the Reds and the Wallabies. It's no secret that Quade is disillusioned at the moment. Well, like, as, as a 5A, you, you like to hope that you've got input into the game plans and stuff, and, and sometimes as sort of your input um, sort of goes in one ear and out the other. And that, well, again, it's like... If you're going to pick an attacking player, um, and especially at 10, you sort of want to work around playing attacking rugby. And um, you know, I think that that's not really a place for me to say because I, you know, I'm, I'm just striving here to be the best that I can be. And that hope and intent is that you know, things are fixed from this point on and it makes it a better environment for, for people moving forward if I'm involved or if I'm not. And reassess my life, what, what was important. Uh, what wasn't and, and make sure I was on the right path to when I come back to playing football I was going to be a better person and a better player. Two years are there for you. Will you perform you know, as good as you did? And that's why I've done so much hard work is because I don't want to perform as good, I want to be better than when I, when I last played the game. Is it more than the skinny little kid from Tokoroa could ever imagine? Oh, it has to be. Like when, when I was a skinny little kid in and took it all. I'm still pretty skinny now, but um, I didn't know what life was, was going to throw at me. Um, you know, I, was, I was happy kicking a, a football around in the backyard. Um, I had, had dreams and ambition. I had a, a poster of a car up on my wall as a, like a five-year-old that you know, my nana brought for me. And I still got that poster at mum's. And, and I always wished to be able to drive a car like that or something like that, you know, as a kid, you just think, oh, you'd never be able to do something like that. And uh, to now have you know, everything um, that I do have and, and be so grateful for it is, uh, is, is just a feeling that I can't explain. Week after saying he couldn't see a future in rugby, Quade Cooper has agreed to a new two-year deal with the ARU. His contract, worth a rumoured $800,000 a season, puts an end to six months of speculation.
Clinton say that. Malcolm made him say that. Bill Clinton, oh boy, yeah, he made him say that. I mean, dag, do I got a blab? Make some people mad just to grab me that precious glam like I'm Smeagol's hand. Nah, man, ain't even right. And I won't test the road, cause I keep this next to my heart. It's